This man Kimura was moving different this arc. No games could be played this time around. Bro heard he had his first title match and started sweating. Cause he know he going up against that slender man built nigga Mashiba. And if you know Mashiba, he gonna go for that W by any means possible. Draymond Green chokeholds and all. Turned that man Miata into a straight victim by stepping on his foot. Bro huh? don't postpone that Epo rematch by 30 years. He does not give a damn. And that sister obsession that he has is filling him to the utmost capacity. Had his brother Kimura get Getting nightmares of his flicker jab days before the fight. But ironically, Kimura decided to train with one of the victims, Miyata. And so they proceed to have a sparring session. And Miyata is ducking and weaving everything thrown at him. And when Bro tries to sneak his ass from behind, Kimura said, Boom! Watch your cheek, boy! Which was his final glory. Because Miyata starts blocking his blows and goes on offense. And he steps in and said, Body work! Right hand! Uppercut! All it took was three. And when Buddy wakes up, Miata then tells him that he's an 80 overall with no Hall of Fame or gold badges. All his shit's on silver and bronze. He ain't got no special move. So we then flash forward a little bit and we see footage of Mashiba just absolutely eviscerating his opponents. You got me fucked up if you think I'm stepping in the ring with a man making no sounds. Something is clearly wrong. But we see the final preparations with a training montage. Kimura is out here trying to become a weave master. As he starts training that left hand with a random tire. Not even the rain finna stop this work. And seeing them dance on that tire, Kamagawa would be proud. As he pulls back up to Miyata's gym with a fresh mustache. That's how you know he been putting in that work. As they begin sparring yet again. And he just proceeds to slip all the flicker jabs in his way. Hitting him with that left hand that he's been cooking up. As that visual prowess activates. As he does a mean step in. For the final blow that's about to connect. And after hearing that praise, it was finally time. It's fight day. Bro was in the locker room stretching like this was game 7. Until he Jen just decides to drop a huge bombshell. And he's finna retire if he takes this L. Had this nigga Epo trembling in his sketchers. But Aoki said, hold up. Let him cook. Because even though he said all that nonsense about retiring, he has every intention of catching his fight. W today. As he walks straight into the light. Hey, 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 hey. My nigga, any closer and they just about to give us a Naruto vs Sasuke part 2. I swear this might be the longest head-to-head -head stare off we've seen in this series. Mashiba's Hall of Fame Intimidator badge is not working today. But now it's time. We now begin the boxing. As Kimura steps in, charging straight ahead with tunnel vision. But then he gets spooked as that flicker jab starts revving. Mashiba's left hand is so legendary that they're out here calling it a damn scythe. But Kimura said, nah, we train for this. As he slips the first one. Or so we thought. My nigga, what in the gum gum no? I ain't know Luffy was in a boxing anime. And now bro starts spamming like he's firing rounds. Relax, buddy. We just started. As we Kimura starts weaving like crazy but still can't escape the scythe. As he gets blasted by a jab. Putting him on the ropes just getting yoinked. But he escapes the assault and Lord Jesus. Nigga done popped up looking like he had a life and death battle with an orange cat. And Mashiba is we not stopping. This spamming is working. Cause <laughs> that combo done left my man's knees weak his arms are heavy had bro's parents watching stress out their damn minds but even with all the punishment kimura still got that fire in his eyes he finna get to cooking for sure ski as he dodges the next jab or so we thought it's looking like a certified knockdown it's night night for sure bro done put a whole kamogawa as the round ends but that next round begins with more of the same work. That cheek is getting blasted. No body blows, just headshots. And nigga, this massacre just proceeds to go on for the next five rounds, literally. Give us a whole time skip. And we just come back to bro's eye now the size of a golf ball. As his mother cowers in fear. As another jab lands. Dropping him to his ass. Man is slumped. But somehow he manages to get back up swiftly as the round ends. But due to this 
pitiful performance and ass whooping that he's receiving. Bro's parents leave the match early. I'll be damned. But after a little self-reflection and realizing that he's not trying to be a pussy of a father like he was in the past, they go back on to cheer their son. And Bro's giving straight body work out there. First offense I've seen from him tonight. As he's now fully adjusted to them flicker jabs. And goes back to the body. And now that he has his master plan with these step-ins, he charges up a left hand that connects to the body. Is what I thought. The Slender Man manages to block it. But Kimura keeps spamming body blows trying to break that guard. As Mashiba starts cheating, sending a KSI elbow. But that is not about to stop him. As the visual prowl responds in as the round ends. And round number 8 begins with Kimura weaving non-stop as a flurry of jabs rain down on him. But just like his training, he slips the jab and charges a mean left hand to the body. That's a chin blasting upper connects. But that's not stopping him though. No Mashiba said nigga that chin is open again. But we didn't get the cleanest, and I mean the cleanest, step in in the series. We play that shit. But he then throws another left to the body. As he starts remembering his countless years of repetition. As he said he's putting all five years of his experience in this final right hand. Bro done lifted both his feet off the canvas plus rearranged his whole right arm as he lands back first to the canvas. This might be the definition of a 3-1 comeback in boxing. But like I said at the beginning of this video, this nigga will do anything it takes to not lose. As he gets back up roaring. As he comes back starting another barrage of flickers. But Kimura done finally landed his first clean body blow. As Mashiba is now swinging mad confused on whether he aiming for the face or the body. As Kimura starts closing the distance yet again. And then mm, 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 mm. body work going crazy. Bro is out here looking like a machine. Though not gonna lie Mashiba low key eating those. That is until a nasty one lands dropping his guard. Which then leads him into turning those hips. Charging up that killer right hand that proceeds to cave his face. Mason. Had his sis say no me chan as he bounces off them ropes like that Ebo fights. But as he's falling under Oni chan bonds in, causing him to clinch for his damn life. And bro would not let go until that bell rang. And that next round begins with pure desperation. As Mashiba said, fuck the flickers and goes in with his right hand. But they then go on a crazy barrage. Joint was giving me Ipo for Sendo vibes. So Mashiba clips him with a clean right, leading into a chin blasting upper. Now he proceeds to start him in left right like he's doing a whole Dempsey roll. This combo is insane. But sadly for Mashiba, Kimura got that visual prowess as he comes back attacking that cheek. My man's is shook out there as his knees are weak, his arms are heavy. Kimura is going on straight offense as he weaves the clinch and mm, 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 mm. this is nasty body work as another one connects and then another one. My god. God, he cannot be stopped. As is now time for the finisher. That guard is dropped. As his final right hand charges, but Mashiba tries to counter. But Kimura lands first, sending his mouthpiece flying into the sky, is what I thought. Because they both landed simultaneously. But you can see the mismatch. Kimura is leaning back as Mashiba is standing straight. As his punch's impact fell short of full power. As he starts falling to the canvas. As the image of the belt disappears from his mind. And it's looking like a guaranteed night night as bro's about to throw in that towel. But Aoki said, hold up. Let my nigga Kimura cook, which is what proceeds to happen. Because he gets up with that Kamogawa gym determination. Squaring up visual prowess intact, ready to go. Shut your ass up. As Mashiba starts a final charge, technique is out the window. All he care about is seeing him dead or unconscious. As Kimura steps in, and as they're both going in for the final right hands that are about to connect for Shursky. <laughs> the match ends. My dog was on Rock Lee timing. He's earned my respect. Had me tearing up on the rewatch. Put him on white beard status. As he slowly wakes up throwing his final right hand into his best friend's hand. Not even knowing that he lost. As the tears begin to flow. He officially fought his last fights. As he retires only 3 centimeters short. Yeah,